Pirates hosting the Mets, and the Mets are minus 134 on the money line. The Pirates are plus 114. The over under nine and a half runs. The Mets laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 114, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win by two or more. And the Pirates getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 137, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And the Mets put in, got their asses kicked today. The Pirates put up 14 runs on them. They hit seven home runs and ran out of fireworks. Go figure. For, uh, the weather is supposed to be 85 degrees, 10 mile an hour winds from the right to the left, and a 1% chance of rain. Peterson pitched once against the Pirates last year. Three and two-thirds, one run, one earn. They lost 7-4. He struck out five. Falter pitched against the Mets this year. Five innings, two runs, two earn. They lost 9-1. He struck out two. Oh, he struck out four in that game. Forgive me. Head-to-head, -head, the home team's on a five-game winning streak. The home team is 8-2. and two. The Mets are 7-3 and three against the Pirates in their last 10. The favorite has won the last five they've played against each other. The favorite is nine and one on the money line. The favorite winning by multiple runs, laying a run and a half, is eight and two. There's only been one one-run game in their last ten meetings. The over is hit in their last two. The over is six and four, and the over nine and a half runs is five and five. The Mets are five and zero oh in Peterson's last five starts, which makes sense as to why they're the favorite in this game. They are the over is four zero and one in his last five starts. Five and two-thirds innings pitched, 5.4 hits, 2.2 earned runs, 3.8 strikeouts, 2.6 walks, 0.4 home runs, 90.8 pitches per game, 16.6 pitches per inning. For the Pirates, they're one and four in Falter's last five starts. The under is three and two in those starts. Four and two-thirds innings pitched, six hits, 3.2 runs, three of which were earned, 4.2 strikeouts, two walks per game, 0.6 home runs per game, 79.6 pitches per game and 17.4 pitches per inning the Mets are five and five in their last 10 they're slumping they're on a three game losing streak nine runs 12 runs one run 16 runs seven runs in a win five runs in a win shut out in a loss and then two runs in their ass whooping that they took today for the Pirates they are five and five in their last 10 11 runs nine runs five runs and 16 runs four runs in a loss five runs in a win two runs in a loss and then 14 runs in the demolition of the Mets that they put on them today. The Mets have been playing well with Peterson on the mound, and Falter got Falter didn't pitch bad. It's just, you know, whenever you have to trust Chapman, which I don't. I'll take the Mets in this one. I say they snap their losing streak. I will take the Mets with the money line. I will take the Mets laying the runs, and I'm going over. The reason I took the Pirates today was because Skeens was on the mound. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.